Sayang, stop worrying. We just met the child welfare officer yesterday, right? And she likes us. If she really likes us, why does she want to meet us again? Just a follow-up interview. It's normal. Really hope you're right, Sayang. Sayang, stop worrying, okay? At least I know she likes me. What if she doesn't like me? Then use your Heartland Hero Charm. Oh, yeah. I didn't use that yesterday. I forgot. No wonder. Uh, Diana? Mm -hmm. What time are you going to clean Tanya's place? Mom, I'm really busy today. I don't have time. Tanya promised. Okay. Um, I'll go over in the afternoon. Thank you. Mm -hmm. May, mm -hmm. you're really going? You want mom to get mad at me? It's really important to her. So, um, have I told you lately that you're awesome? No. Well, you're awesome. Not that you know. As promised, the share organics lease vetted by legal. <sighs> it's about time. I'll contact Mr. Batista's secretary and arrange for it to be signed. It's not necessary. I'll be seeing him tonight at the charity ball. I'll settle with him. I can meet you there with the documents. It's okay. I'll be asking Shirley to come with me. We're going to spend some long time. Thank you. Hi, Rashida. Welcome back. Hi, hello. hello. Uh, let me get you a drink. Thanks. Uh, but I was thinking we could do individual interviews today. Uh, individual interviews? We didn't prepare for individual interviews. You don't need to prepare anything. It's just a simple chat. Oh, uh, okay. So why don't you wait in the bedroom? bedroom. Outside the interview. Okay. Let's start, Shirley. Yeah. You're meeting Chris? Oh, um, he's actually bringing some lunch over. He, he probably bought extra. You want to join us? She's having lunch with me. Oh, Mr. T, you really snuck up on us. <laughs> you should be used to me popping by by now. Anyway, please cancel Shelling's appointments in the afternoon. What? Why? We are going to get you a dress for the charity ball tonight. Oh, but... Um... Batista will be there. I think it would be the best time to get him to sign off on the lease. And finally, you can get your renovations done and launch the shop. Sure. Yeah, let's go. So, Lina, tell me why you're interested in adopting when you already have a biological child. Are you asking if I will favour Rian over our adopted child? Well, it is a possibility. I have seen cases like this. I will never play favourites. I will love all my children equally, biological or not. What makes you so sure? Personal experience. I don't want my kids to go through what I went through. What happened? Um, my late brother, Nasi. He was the good son, the favourite one. And then there was my kaka, the smart and mature one. And then there's me, the naughty one with lousy grades. So anything wrong, it's always my fault. Always. Really? Yeah. There was one time when my kaka broke my mark's expensive vase when she wasn't around. And my mark just assumed that it was me who did it. So when my kaka confessed that she did it, my mark just forgave her and even praised her for owning up. She didn't even get punished. I just think it's not fair. So there was no way that I could live up to their expectations and standards. So, can I help? You want help to clean? Well, I usually don't. My mom has to force me kicking and screaming, but for some weird reason, you make it look fun. Uh, but, 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 are you calling me weird? Yes. Weird, but fun. Eh, I think I can live with that. Now, get your hands dirty. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you both for being so honest and open with me. You got everything that you need? Most of it. The next stage will be... The home inspection, right? <laughs> yes, to check whether your home is a conducive and safe environment for a child to be raised in. I'll call and arrange a suitable time. Sure. Alright. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you so much. Welcome. Bye. <laughs> I'm glad that's over. <sighs> Sayang. Mm. Your individual interview went okay? I knew she was going to ask about my father. I thought she was going to give me a hard time, but actually she was quite nice. There's just something about this Rashida. Makes you let your gut down. 
let your gut down. What did you tell her? I don't know. I think maybe I messed up. How could you have possibly messed up? Talk too much about my childhood. What your childhood was okay, what? I know, I don't know, lah, sayang. I was just, I was just affected, and I just continued renting. Okay, okay, okay. Don't panic, okay? Um, maybe it's not so bad. I just hope that I didn't ruin our chances. that child welfare officer? I think I messed it up. What did you do? Talk a bit too much about the past. Come, sit down. Sit down. What past? My childhood. Like how you and Bapak love Abang and Kakak more than me. What nonsense is this? You were your Bapak's little baby girl, okay? He spoiled you like mad. We are talking about me, okay? Like how I always got the hand-me-downs and toys that Abang and Kakak didn't want. I remember you always asking for new dolls, okay? And your Bapak could never say no to you. Everybody gave in to you. You're the baby of the family. And I remember how every time something went wrong, you would automatically blame me for it. Like when Kakak broke your vase. Whose fault? My fault. What vase? You're crazy or what? Where is all this coming from? Ma, I think you're just getting old and your memory is failing you. What failing? Your memories are distorted. Excuse me? Tanya, who is more likely to be right? The old, the lady who sometimes forgets her house keys or someone whose childhood was so traumatic that every bit of it stays in her memory? I... Tanya, don't you think she sounds like someone who's watched too many Korean dramas already? Reality all distorted. Um, this is your dad, right? Uh, yeah. That was taken when I was seven at my mom's and dad's wedding. Wedding? That means your mom is. <laughs> Doesn't she look a bit too young to have such a smart and brilliant daughter? <laughs> so she was about your age when she had you. Uh, yeah. My dad was a few years older, but he wasn't ready for commitment yet. But, uh, but they got married anyway. They were in love. If you don't mind me asking, uh, why did they get divorced? Uh, my dad's job took him away a few months at a time. I guess the physical distance turned into an emotional distance, and they were just fighting all the time. Divorce sucks, but um, a couple that stays together in a loveless relationship and is always fighting, that, that sometimes sucks even worse. Take it from me. I know. Thank you. Back on. The neighbors are going to complain. The music helps me concentrate. My competition is coming up. I want to win. I want to win. I want to win. Eh, hey, isn't your O-level mother tongue paper coming up? Yeah. And should you be studying? I got bored, so I took a break. Break or excuse not to study? Abang, Malay language isn't something you study. It'll come naturally to me, since I'm Malay. It's part of who I am. Okay, by that reasoning, you should be getting full marks, huh? Abang, I... Don't abang, abang me. Study. I'll test you later. No music. Wow. 
Well, it's possible that you're both right. What? How is that possible? In my line of work, witness testimonies can be very unreliable, especially when there are emotions involved. It can be very hard to be objective. So you mean I should get more witnesses who saw my mom punishing me? Okay, enough. This is getting more and more ridiculous, and I don't have time and patience to listen to Lina's nonsense. I'm going back to the clinic. Bye. 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 You hear that? She takes my pain as nonsense. She must be faking that she can't even remember. I don't think she is. Maybe she thought that she was punishing you for your own good. But it's different for a child. They can hold on to that kind of pain for years after. Cacing hendak menjadi naga. Ah, uh, what's the meaning? A worm who wants to become a dragon. Ah, uh, that means a person who acts bigger than they are. Not bad. Okay, what's this one? Ah, uh, uh, dalam kilat ada kilau. There's brightness in lightning. Why is it thunder? No, 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 lightning, lightning. What's the meaning? Uh, something about bad weather. Bad weather, your head. Ah, uh, it means wait. It means ah, uh, it means having hidden meanings and otherwise normal conversation. Ah, uh, that's going to be my next guess. Ah, uh, still guessing, ah? Uh? Now you know why you need to study. I'm just not academically inclined. MMA is what I meant to do. You're just lazy. You're spending too much time on MMA. But MMA is fun. Studying isn't. Imagine how fun it'll be when Chet Sama finds out you're doing badly for your exams. Ah, scared, right? Ah, oh, Adam. How long was your training today? Ah, uh, three hours. Good. How's your diet coming along? No, I. No fair. No sugar, just protein. Great. I have good news for you. There's an investor who's interested in you even before the fight. An investor? Yep, big shot. If you win and impress him, it will change your life. It doesn't matter. What do you mean doesn't matter? I'm doing this for myself, just to see what I'm capable of. Okay, whatever you're doing this for, just make sure you focus. That's the only way you will win, okay? Was it tough for you also? I mean, your childhood? Well, I was adopted, and I look nothing like my parents, and bullies like to pick on kids that are different. That's so mean. <laughs> Children can be mean. But I think what made it worse was that my adoptive mother didn't believe me. The kids used to dump my shoes in water and I would have to go home without them. And my mother didn't believe that I was being bullied. She thought that I was playing a fool and lying to her. So she used to punish me by caning me. Wow, really? I never thought, I mean, since she adopted you and really wanted a child, wouldn't she take really good care of you? No, but she did, in her own way. Anyways, it's in the past. We're fine now. just say that you look absolutely gorgeous. Thank you. There's something missing, though. What's this? Wait. My mom gave this to me on my 16th birthday. I, I lost it a long time ago. Why is it with you? You dropped it the first time we met. And 
I've been holding on to it ever since so that I can return it to you at the right time. And I think today, I think it's the right time. Shilin. You know, in the past, all I thought about was making more money. But these days, all I can think about is running away with you. Running away? What about your business, your work? I don't care. Give it off to charity, sell it all away, I don't care. You're joking, right? No, I'm not. Let's go. Into the bag. Yeah. No way! Oh my god! You're horrible! I this know you're bad manners! Hey, Diana, the place looks great. Um, I had help from this one. We make a good team. <laughs> I don't come cheap though. Rainbow cake. Add two slices of that and a cupcake. Hey, you cost more than Eddie. I'm smarter than Eddie. Diana, let me pay you. No, no, uh, I know that that's that's okay. No, I, I insist. <laughs> no, really, it's really okay. Mom, why are we talking about money? We're family. And uh, you know what that means. You can pay me in cake. Two slices of rainbow cake and a cupcake and we're good. Wait, so you're like robbing me to pay you? Thanks, Diana. Mm-hmm. Andrew, how are you? Hi. This is Andrew Lam, my longtime business associate. Hi. Hello, Shirley. When was the last time I uh, met you? Excuse me. Excuse me. Mr. Batisa? Hey, hi, Shirley. How, how are you? Batisa. Hey, how are you? Peter. Hey. Good, good. Uh, very good. Uh, yeah, uh, regarding the lease. Is it ready? Yes, it is. Okay, then let's sign it tomorrow. Is that okay for everyone? Yeah, great, thank oh, okay. you. Hey, 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 how are you? Hey, hi, thank you. Oh, sorry, excuse me. Go ahead. Well, now that business is settled, I was thinking we can relax and enjoy the rest of the evening. Yeah. Actually, sure. we could, uh, I'm thinking after this, we could. Sorry. Excuse me. Hi, Ma. No, it's Suzanne. Uh, what? You wanted me to call you? Melissa is upset. Okay, I leave right now. Bye. Is everything okay? Um, not really. Melissa is upset with her exams. She wants to see me. I think I better go. I understand. I'll send you home. It's okay, I drove. You drank, you shouldn't drive. Uh, Peter? Well, um, anyway, as... I can grab a cab. Don't worry about me. You should stay here. Business is important, right? Um, I see you around. Bye. Yeah. Regarding the email I sent you last week, have yeah. you considered a business proposal yet? Yeah. Hey, so you see verbal diarrhea on your officer. I just couldn't help myself. <laughs> I just started talking and all those stories from the past came out. I even had an argument with my mom, okay? Huh? And worse still, I even got Tanya involved. Tanya? Apparently, she's also had bad childhood experiences. Mm, like what? I better not tell you. Why not? It's personal stuff. Wah, you're so close already. Uh. Now I'm sharing personal stuff already. And eh, hey, I'm not other people, you know. I'm your BFF. I know, but still... She just confided in me. Fine. Actually, come to think of it, she's quite a nice person. Thank you. <laughs> Hey, hi, Lina. Um, I just saw your mom. She's still angry with me? Nah, she's calmed down. Go home and talk to her. I will. <laughs> anyway, Auntie Lian, 
Did you know Tanya's adoptive parents when you gave her up for adoption? Oh yeah. I knew her adoptive mother, Ahua. She was a family friend. My sister, Li Ting, knew her very well. They are close friends? I let Ahua raise Tanya because Li Ting trusted her. Uh, why do you ask? Oh, nothing. Just wondering. You and Sulaiman doing your research on adoptions? Yeah. Just like you never know how an adopted child might turn out. It's hard to tell what sort of adoptive parents a child might end up with. Yeah, very true. Hi, you better go home soon. Yeah. yeah. Hey. Hi. I got a message. What's wrong? Oh, sorry. I'm a little bit tipsy. I can't drive and I can't get a cab. That's why I messaged you. Sorry. Why do you keep apologizing? Let's go. I'll make sure copies of the signed contract get to both you and Mr. Batusa. Mr. Tay, would there be anything else? No. Very professionally handled. Thank you, Gina. Oh, I, I think I better get back to office too. Oh, I think we should celebrate by having dinner tonight. Tonight? Hmm? I have something on. Tomorrow? You know, when the contract is signed, there's a lot of work to do. Renovation, renovation, supplies. You have to eat eventually, you know. Yeah, but unfortunately, I think there's not enough time now. I'll see you around. Peter, bye. 